Franklin Delano Roosevelt served as the one of the best presidents in American history and the longest serving president in the United States. He served as the 32nd president. The Great Depression was on its way to President Hoover's presidency, but when President Hoover tries for re-election in 1932, he gets beaten and defeated by the formal gov governor of New York, Franklin Delano Roosevelt, as a Democrat in 1932. When 51-year-old Franklin D. Roosevelt won the presidency, he brought new ideas to the Oval Office and to his desk. In 1935, Congress and the President agreed to create Social Security, and the President thought it would be a great way to help un unemploy get jobs during the Great Depression. When Nazi Germany, the leader of the Nazis, Adolf Hitler, started attacking Jewish people by their religion and by their nationality, they created big problems with the United States. The United States was protecting these foreign countries that were being attacked by Germany. The Nazi party was later destroyed by the Americans and Germany was defeated by America. After the war ended with Germany, another disastrous thing happened. Pearl Harbor was attacked from the Japanese Navy. President Roosevelt was one of the first was one of the first presidents to make a, to make to ask for a declaration of war since Woodrow Wilson. He asked Congress personally for a declaration of war with the famous quotes The only thing we have to fear is fear itself. But this decision was a decision that President Roosevelt had to deal with and truly defined his presidency. The Japanese, China, and the United States, China and America were liberals against Japan. FDR's predecessor, Harry S. Truman, who would later become the president upon the death of FDR, would actually drop an atomic bomb on Ashmima, Japan, and other places as well. President Roosevelt did not let them defeat them, and that's why America won this war. In the early 1930s, President Roosevelt had an idea that would change the way American citizens would work. The president had created and signed the Treaty of the New Deal. Behind the scenes, behind the scenes, this treaty was a successful treaty to get unemployed people back to work. That's why President Roosevelt won an unprecedented, unprecedented four presidential terms. Behind the scenes, President FDR struggled deeply with polio in his leg, but that did not stop him being the, the president of his country, and that did not st stop him from having bad decisions. As the president had his final and fourth inaugural day on January 20th, 1945, the last one he would have until his death. Harry S. Truman would later take the oath of office as the new president of the United States. President Roosevelt had died in Warm Springs, Georgia in 1945. Pr president Roosevelt died exactly 74 years after the Civil War had begun, exactly. I'd like to thank you for watching this video. And these, this is the reason why President Roosevelt was ranked 
one of the best presidents ever.